where Chief Reynolds died. Sandstorms would have buried the body long ago. I suggest scanning. Karkins. Pathfinder, there is an armor piece buried deep. A leg bracer. Scan indicates tissue and bone fragments clinging to it. DNA identified as Chief Reynolds. Indications suggest his body was torn to pieces. So the Chief became Karkin food. Circle of life can be gruesome. The remaining armor will be scattered, or perhaps brought to a nest. The chest piece and his Omni tool may explain his death. Then we keep searching and scanning. Another armor piece. Chief Reynolds' helmet. The search continues. Earth had formations like this. Made a lot of kids think of alien worlds. Water and weather. Nothing tougher in the long run. Pathfinder. The scan has picked up Chief Reynolds' chest piece. Confirming single shot. Unable to determine weapon type, but entry point was at the back. Exit blast through the chest. By all accounts, Nilkin was in front of the Chief when he fired. So it wasn't his shot that killed him. The Chief's Omni tool might shed some light. Radiation levels are severe. Seek safety immediately. Picking up additional armor scraps. I believe it's a trail leading to a cave nearby. Could be where the nest is located. Parking nest, all right. Fan out. Confirming initiative equipment, including Omni tool assigned Accessing to the security data. chief. The chief was scanning at the time of if death. Power it up. The scan picked up its data. two shots. One, a standard initiative rifle report, which missed. The other from behind, a Ket pulse weapon. This proves Milken is innocent. He didn't shoot Reynolds. Seems clear to me. Good work, Pathfinder. There is also an audio recording. Go ahead and play it. No! Where's Nilkin? Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Son of a bitch. Confirming. 
Voice identified as suspect, Nilkin. So he did not kill the chief. But he meant to. Need another chat with the man. Pathfinder, do you have just a minute? Ryder, isn't it? Kerry Tavessa, freelance vid maker. This is Hakim, my producer. I could use your help. What are you looking for? Director Tans asked for an uplifting documentary on the initiative. Translation, paint rainbows over our problems. But our problems are history. People deserve the truth, not propaganda. Nice to see someone so devoted to her work. That's kind. Sometimes the camera makes people shy away from me. That's a shame. <laughs> so that's what I need. The truth, I mean. Someone needs to record the history we're making. It takes integrity to record the truth and nothing but. Well, I do my best. And you could help me out. The heart of my documentary will be an interview series. I was hoping you'd take part. I want the dirt and blood of our story, not the convenient fairy tale Tan's looking for. Interested? Okay. Interview away. Let's start at home. Fourteen months and the Nexus still isn't finished. Arcs are missing, we have people in exile. By any standard, this wasn't the plan. Our leadership describes these as anticipated issues. Would you agree? We still have to fix them. Everyone, leaders included, needs to pitch in. Let's be honest about these challenges and how we're going to face them. Nice. Won't make you popular with the leaders, but it's good to hear. Bandwidth means I'm transmitting in short bursts, so that's all for now. But you can bet I'll have more questions later. This was more fun than I expected. You were great. I'll get to work editing. Hi there. I hear you went down to Eos. Did you find anything to help my case? An enemy blast to the back killed the chief. Your shot missed. What? You, you're kidding me. Thank the spirits. This is great. Hold on there. The chief's Omni tool recorded you over the body. Sam, playback. Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Shit. Not only did you think you killed him, you meant to. But you just said I didn't, so it doesn't matter, right? The conviction will have to be overturned. The sentence thrown out. Director Tan will determine what's to be done. You did try to cover it all up. Look, I'm sorry I lied, but if my shot missed, I'm innocent, plain and simple. We'll see about that. Well, old man, we're getting there. Put in a good word for us. Something I can help you with? Director, I checked out that murder. Nilkin didn't do it, but there's proof that he meant to. This is unfortunate. We're trying to give the people a sense of stability, leadership they think they can count on. And we're setting precedent for justice here in Andromeda. Now this, a convicted murderer who didn't commit the murder. These things are almost never black and white. I know. If we suppress the evidence and uphold the conviction, we're banishing a man for a crime he technically didn't commit. If we throw the conviction out, we're freeing a man who tried to take matters into his own hands, then covered it up. Your investigation complicated this. You should take responsibility for the outcome. Do we still exile him for murder? It was crazy down there, life and death. But his shot didn't kill Reynolds. We have to let him go. You're a bottom line type of person. I hope we don't regret it. All right, so be it. He will do community service for his role in the chaos. But he's a free man. 
Well, at least we'll have the sordid business behind us. Legs feeling a little better. Are you sure you want to do this? Looks like the muscles bruised. I am. The good news is the bone is for the best. I'm sure What's the for the best? Getting around to it. I'm putting Nilkin here back into stasis. The conviction was overturned, but everyone still treats me like a murderer. Marriott heard the truth. She left me. I just want to go to sleep and wake up when things are blown over. Makes sense. Good luck. <laughs>